Thank you for staying up late with us tonight. First on four, the University of Texas Rio Grande Valley has announced results of a student survey on sexual assault and misconduct. CBS 4's Priscilla Estrada tells us about the shocking statistics affecting some UTRGV students. A recent study at the University of Texas Rio Grande Valley reveals that 5% of students reported having a rape experience and 11% of students experienced stalking since enrollment at the university. Anything on there that's above zero is just not acceptable in any way. Um, but we also know that this is something that happens in society. Sexual harassment, sexual assault, it, it happens in our society. So it's something that um, we're taking very seriously. Over 3,800 random undergraduate and graduate students at the university voluntarily participated in an in-depth survey called Cultivating Learning and Safe Environment during fall of 2015 and spring of 2016. Uh, well, I'm glad that the school is uh, trying to spend some time on it. I think it's, a, it's an important issue, of course, uh, especially uh, women that are usually more targeted than men, so uh, I think it's, it's good for, for everybody. Some questions in the survey included whether students have ever experienced receiving offensive remarks based on appearance, body, or sexual activities, or whether they have ever experienced threatening messages online. It's the only time a system of institutions has taken this hard a look at sexual assault and sexual misconduct and our students' perceptions of their safety on campus. The survey is part of the first phase to better understand, address, and reduce acts of sexual harassment, stalking, dating, or domestic abuse and violence. The system allocated $1.7 million for the study across Texas systems. I have a late lab, so I'm walking by myself, so I do think that it's a really good idea and like it's just really good that they're taking time to actually do surveys and see people's responses and opinions and try to help like make the campus safer. Croyle adds that not enough students know, in her opinion, where to go if they encounter a situation. The survey showed 76% of students did not tell anyone about their particular incident when it happened. One of the ways that we're responding to that right now is we're redesigning our websites because we know oftentimes students go first to our web resources to make sure it's absolutely clear that if they have any concerns, if they think something might happen or is happening, they know exactly where to go. The next step after the survey is to add or implement new programs to ensure a safer campus. In Edinburgh, Priscilla Estrada, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com. Some other key findings include 72% of victims reported believing that UTRGV would take the report of sexual assault and misconduct seriously and 70% felt safe while on the campus.